Hey, Toby here from tobychristensen.com. Thanks for checking out my coaching tip of the day. This is number nine of 10 videos of raising your happy factor. <laughs> this is about blame. I cannot tell you how many times I work with people in the corporate sector, in the entrepreneurial sector, in the human resources area that do nothing but blame everybody and everything around them for what is happening. Blame is a destructive energy. It creates divisiveness. It forces people to take sides. It creates conflict and it feeds disruption, not positive disruption. So what if we would let go of blame? And let's look at cause and effect. If you want a different effect, create a different cause. If somebody did something that affected you in a certain way, fix it or look for other options. Sometimes it feels like people are intentionally trying to destroy us, trying to hurt us, trying to trip us up. Maybe they are, but what can you learn from it? How can you shift that around to be a cause and effect? You know, one of the most powerful things that I learned when I was in, when in my younger years, I took, I took Kung Fu. And I was a lover, not a fighter, right? I never had any kind of, I think I got into two fights when I was in elementary school or something, you know, but that was about it. I hated violence. But one of the things that I learned was how to, how to dance with adversarial energy in this Kung Fu training that really helped me look at conflict differently. When I didn't take it seriously, I simply looked at it as cause and effect, and I learned to avoid taking the direct hit. And I learned how to take that conflicting energy and move it for, in a direction that was on my behalf. Everything changed. When I put that into my business consulting and my coaching, it is exciting to watch people's views of situations change regardless of what has happened. Instead of blaming, think cause and effect. If you want a different effect, create a different cause. That's your coaching tip of the day. You have a great one. We'll see you next time.